So it's October 21st, 2017, and I made a video out here in the yard probably close to a month ago now where I was figuring that we weren't going to have much longer before frost hit. Then I made another one about two weeks ago. And amazingly here, October 21st, we still have not had a frost. And um, at this point, on the last I looked at the 10-day forecast, it looked like uh, we were probably going to go all the way until next Friday, which I think is the 27th, before we have a good likelihood of a frost. So, um, you know, late in the season here, some of the hosts are deteriorating a little bit. Some of them are getting a little color. Um, that may have been more about those getting a little dry than anything because we haven't gotten into frosting temperatures yet. I think the coldest we've seen this season is we might have had a night that hit 30 eight or 39 but for the most part we've had nights in the 40s so we finally had some trees here in the city that are changing but other things are barely doing anything so this is pretty amazing for wisconsin in the third week of october to have stuff looking like this still um it's really pretty incredible look at all these bushes the dogwoods are starting to change some now look this is an autumn blaze maple Look at the top of that. That's super pretty. Um, so there's definitely some really pretty trees, and some trees have um, lost most or almost all their leaves now. Uh, this is a Norway maple, and it's barely changed at all. It's, it's almost all green. Just a little bit of color up at the very top. See here some dogwoods with uh, some yellow to them and dropping some leaves, but not a whole lot. Here, this one has more yellow to it. You can come up and uh, we'll see some more. I didn't look at the temperature, but it's uh, probably like 72 today. These are still in pretty good shape. And a couple are fading a little bit, probably getting dry. There's uh, a few more hosta here, still doing relatively well. Some are changing a little bit. So then our garden that's usually done and pulled out a full month before this, we still have some tomatoes on the plants. I mean, heck, that tomato plant looks really pretty nice. And um, some of those little tomatoes are still ripening up and probably really good to eat. This is just incredible for this late in the season. Our kale is still looking okay. Um, our herbs, our um, basil has been well, doing well still. So um, we're going to be wrapping it up pretty quick, but this is incredible to make it in our gardening season until the uh, end of October. And then there's our ash tree. That one has most of its leaves down. But then our maple tree behind it just has a little color, but uh, not much. So that's where we're at.